All right, Master Shredder, talk to the people, man. Let them know what's getting ready to go down. Salute, people. Once again, Master Shredder, train different, gain different. That's good money with some more info to help y'all go, go in and keep y'all strong out here. So we going into the top 10 immune system boosters for the coming, changing the season, changing weather. So we don't want you out here crazy, missing work and just out of the field, out of yeah. action. Coughing in people's face yeah, on the train and all. Face <laughs> on the train and just putting other people out of action. Too. Yeah, exactly. So the best way to do things is to take care of yourself, take care of everybody else, right? right? So um, number one, um, I'm gonna put on that list is going to be elderberry. Like elderberry, because it's very good, high vitamin C, high other minerals as well too. Um, good for like your like respiratory system as well. So I like those because it's very good for your immune system, help you sleep at night as well too, help you rest. Love elderberry, one of the best things to boost your immunity. Good vitamins in that. Number two, I'm gonna say I like sea moss. I like sea moss in there because it's gonna get rid of mucus. And once you don't have too much mucus flowing through your body, your body can function properly and it won't get dry and inflamed and cause your body to work harder and cause you to be tired and wear down your immune system. So the less mucus you have, the better your immune system can function. All right? So, um, Another one that's good for you is hibiscus. Or some people, they, you can say a sorrow when you make it as a juice, so it's good as the juice. And also as the tea, hibiscus is great as a tea because it's boosting your um, iron, very good in iron. So like for people with anemia and just other problems, other inflammation problems as well. That's why you want to get hibiscus in there. And it's good for your immune system as well to boost that up and detoxify your body. So you want to get the hibiscus in there, the hibiscus root, to drink it as a tea, or like when you doing the sorrow, you could do that as well too. Another okay. good one. That's number three. That's yeah, that's three. three. Another okay. good one is um, yellow dog. Yellow dock is very good for cleaning mucus, inflammation from out of your nasal cavity and things of that nature. And out of your, so out of your sinuses, so that's out of your chest, your nose, your head, your ears, out of your stomach. All of this is, is one of the best things to get mucus out of there. So that's gonna have your immune system feeling nice and proper. You're gonna have energy, you're gonna be warm blood is gonna be that much more stronger because it's it's like bitter so the bitter things is the ones that that like really strengthen your blood so that's four um, five another one is this one is shave grass it's not actually grass it's like a herb shave grass aka also known as horsetail so that's another name for it. and what this is good for is like building your immune system, cleansing your blood, good for your hair, making your hair grow, uh, um, you know, having a healthy bladder function, giving you energy. And yeah, shave grass, horsetail, unique. And it's affordable as well too. So that's the great thing about all of these herbs. They're all affordable. And you can keep, you know, you could keep brewing them so that's why they're good. So that was five. Another one I like is blue vervain. That's another herb and root that's good for cleansing your blood, detoxifying your, your body, you know, getting rid of inflammation, arthritis and all of those things, and protecting your immune system because it's detoxifying your body and helping with all of these ailments as well. How does that happen? And boost your immune system to get, to make these functions happen, your immune system has to get boosted. So that's what blue vervain does, that's a, that's a root. So that's six or seven right there, we got it. That's five or six. That's six, all right, so that's six. 
So um, a seven is um, I like this one. This one is from Jamaica. Probably y'all ain't probably heard of this one before, but it's very good. This one is called Guinea Hen Weed. Guinea Hen Weed. Hen Weed. You can find this in a lot of health stores, health health stores and like herbal herbal spots. So what the Hen Weed does is it got like high iron, like high calcium. Um, yeah, another blood purifier and cleanser. Good for cleaning out mucus and good for giving you energy and good for boosting, boosting your testosterone and you know, improving for impotency for God, for men and things like that because of the blood purifying effects of this thing. So that's Guinea Henweed from Jamaica, all right? Another good one. That was seven. Is, that, was yeah, seven. That, was, that was seven. Um, eight. Is, that's seven? No, that was six. No, that was seven. That was seven. Mm -hmm. So, eight. Um, I like Cheney Root. This is another one from Jamaica. That's eight. This is um, good for your blood pressure, cholesterol, um, yeah, impotency and cleansing your blood out as well so things that's cleaning your blood like i said before is going to help your immune system get boosted so that's why i got chaining root on there and it's great for men too boosting your testosterone naturally from the herb that's chaining root nine i like to put the spice cinnamon bark like you could put this in i like to put this in like my porridge some teas that I make like any one of these teas that I make like just to add a little flavor to it the sea moss I like to to brew it when I do bubble it up with cinnamon in it to add that spice that spice is good for burning out mucus cleaning out mucus and your blood and that's gonna help for your immune system building your immune system keeping your immune system solid and if you do get knocked down you get back up right quick and you won't be down for too long believe me when I tell you this and last but not least 10 did we say um we got two more ginger and something else ginger of course yeah of course ginger ginger, ginger man I like to eat a piece of ginger every morning especially now I haven't been doing it in the summer because the sun was great enough Good enough for building my immune system as well as other like you know the sea moss and yeah the fruits but like ginger for the winter is so clutch because it's so good for your sinuses anti-inflammation um like having stomach ailments like gas bloatedness pain relief this should have been number one on the list but i like to say last but not least ginger is like one of the top ones man just because of its properties. And Did you have something else or that's about it? Um, 10, um, they, they, I like- You said something about the horse thing? The horse tail, that was earlier. You already the, said that? Yeah, the horse tail. The fever grass, that's the one that we could add in there. Fever grass? Okay. Yeah, that's the one that's pretty good right there. Um, Oh, uh, lemon, the lemongrass. Oh, yeah, lemongrass. Lemongrass. Lemongrass, yeah. You didn't say that yet, right? Yeah, lemongrass. Lemon I'll put grass. lemongrass over the fever grass. Lemongrass, okay. yeah. Lemongrass, very good herb, very good tonic, very high in iron, high in all of the minerals you need to build, not just your immune system, but your body as well. Like, to build these gains and get gains, you want to have these type of herbs. These type of herbs that cleanse your blood, purify, and strengthen them and clean out the mucus from your sinuses and your all of your intestines and you know colon these things a lot of these things too is good for uh cleaning out your colon as well too for y'all guys out here and for my brothers and shit you know how that shit go <laughs> so you want to definitely get those in to keep your colon clean and these herbs help with building the immune system and like impotency, building testosterone um, naturally, and yeah, it's gonna help you gain and help you feel better. 
help you stay up and help you stay solid. Well, that's Shredder's top 10 immune system boosters. You um, right. jump into some of them right now, you know, it's getting a little... Yeah, it's getting a little nippy out here. Yeah, so. we're in the middle of October now, yeah. and, you know. So, you know. Start now taking care of that immune system. Don't yeah. wait till it's 30 degrees out yeah. here. And, and then, you know. you know, you get caught. Yeah. Then you wake up, and it's, you know, it's hard to move. Yeah. You're feeling everything achy, and mm -hmm. you don't want to go through that. Right. Miss time. Mess up your workout routine and you know, yeah. trying to get gains. Yeah, especially if you're trying to get gains yeah. and you want to stay on top of it, you don't want to get knocked down for right. too long. Mm -hmm. And then it's kind of, it will be discouraging. So you don't want to be discouraged. So the best thing to do is to stay up, stay ready so you ain't got to get ready. Okay. All right, if um, go ahead, give them some info. Um, um, if y'all want some gear, y'all want some meal plans, training, plans, consultation, um, anything else business related, one chance in a million at gmail.com. Got um, Billionaire Society. They sponsored me today with the with the drips. Uh, very nice. You can get those on Illionaire Society.com and my YouTube channel, youtube.com slash master shredder got the handle just youtube slash master shredder mm -hmm. it's easy all the links will be in the description box yeah good looking now shredder more coming from my man shredder already all right peace